hi guys welcome back to my channel today we'll be making masks you know because of the pandemic everybody should be wearing a mask just for the safety of everyone so i know the supplies are low so today i'm going to show you how i made a mask i follow this girl off on instagram and she linked up how she made it so i will link her ig below in the description box today we're going to be using two pieces of fabric they're cut at nine and six inches also this is the liner part we will be using a sewing machine, but you could probably use a hand stitch as well. So if you like to know how to make a mask, please stay tuned. If you like videos like this, please let me know. I enjoy doing DIYs. I have more planned. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. First step, we wanna line up our fabric. Make sure the corners are in meeting. If it's overlapping some, that's okay. So it should look like this. Next, we're gonna start sewing. We're gonna sew the longer parts first. So we're gonna stitch this part, and then we're gonna stitch the second side. So we're gonna line up our fabric to the point we want it to start its stitch. We're gonna release it. Cut down the needle and begin the stitching. So this is what my first stitch looked like. So remember we're gonna do the long sides first. So now I'm gonna do the other side. Gonna let it down, place the needle and begin. This is what the second side looked like. I am not a pro, but it does work. So next I'm gonna show you the next following step. So after sewing both long ends of the fabric, we're gonna turn it inside out. So once turning inside out, this is what your seam should look like on both sides. So now I'm going to iron it down so the crease can meet up and lay flawless. So now using an iron, I'm going to iron it down. Just to make sure it's laying flat. ironing you can see how it looks it's very clean and flat so now we're gonna sew the sides so we're gonna do a so we're pinching the sides and meet, making them meet up and we're gonna sew it just like this it's kind of tricky but it doesn't have to be perfect I 
All right, so I'm gonna line it up where I want my needle to start. Let down the latch, put down the needle, and begin to sew. This is what it looks like. We bunch it in and this is how the back looks. We're gonna do the exact same thing to the other side. So my thread snapped, so I only did a little bit of it. So I'm gonna start where it ended at. is how it comes out it's not the best but we're gonna fold it over so you won't really see it anyways so let's do the next step so now after we have sewed the sides this is the inside of it and this is the outside piece of fabric so now we're gonna fold the sides in like this and we're gonna put a piece of elastic string through it so I've cut the elastic string. All I'm gonna do is time in a knot. This will be used for putting behind your earlobe to attach the mask. So once again, we're just going to take the elastic band and fold it over and just sew across that seam. So this is that side not the best because the thread kept snapping so this is the finished product I'm gonna try it on but this is what it looks like here are the seam this is the back and this is the front so this is what it will look like when you wear it and this will open up so If you try this or you find this easy, please like and subscribe to my channel. There will be more DIYs coming soon. So here's what the final product looks like. The pink one is for a child. The orange one is for an adult.